Welcome and smile, Miss ADHD and Divination. Getting back to what I know, loving life and the greatness of Miss ADHD and Divination. So, today is a savory Saturday and I am sexified. In my sanctuary, I've had the opportunity to va va voom, as you can see. And um, if you tune in and tune up from the beginning, you guys know. I get dressed and do my makeup, not because of where I'm going, but because of who I am. And I tell you guys, there is no special occasion. You are special. The occasion is wherever you're going, present yourself. Be the present. Share your gifts. Right. So I'm balling on a budget of non-existent. And I love to exuberate how I feel. So, um, covered up the rash real good. And, uh, this is what made me break out. I didn't realize that I'm allergic to this. Um, but the burning went away. Thank God. Mm -hmm. So, you'd never guess. Let me tell you. Because I don't play games. All of this. Courtesy of donations. As I did laundry today, one of the staff members came by when I was on my porch wearing nothing but a shirt. She says, what are you doing? I said, I'm doing laundry. And uh, she said, oh, we got some clothes. I said, please come get me. I would love to have some. Not only did I get six or five, I got shoes. <laughs> and I love this. I'm not short. I'm just more down to earth than most people. I'm going to make it sexified. If you guys have watched Welcome at Smile long enough, you know that I customize my attire. I like it tight. If it ain't tight, it ain't right. And that being said, I got some wonderful pieces. Uh, let me show you what I got. And I thank God for the ability to bring you this energy, bring you these messages, bring you this frequency, and love life the way that I do. I truly understand and know we are so much more than the circumstances. <laughs> and uh, wherever you presently find yourself, I hope that you shine as the gifted present you are in the present. You like my wordplay, but I'm not playing. So, let me bring you over to my work in progress because um, I started a altar in my new sanctuary where I find myself. And uh, some motivational words. That's me. <sighs> you know, illustrated. And uh, some of my mantras. My daily prayer. May the Lord show me his ways and teach me his paths daily. Because my free will, I know, can be turbulent. <laughs> However, I truly am a humanitarian, guys. You can't pay me enough to fucking do somebody wrong. I just don't see the point in it. I got some beautiful roses or whatever they're called. I'm not sure. Some fruit for my ancestors and my God. And Palma. So, I want to confess something to you as the emperor, empress warrior that I am. When I told you guys, somebody offered me flowers, the, the two plastic flowers. And because of the way I was feeling, I was like, no, I don't want that. But in reality, I truly enjoy and love nature and flowers. And depending on the flower or, you know, how well I'm able to take care of it, I won't pick it because I don't see the sense in killing it, right? However, I also enjoy the decor, the fragrance, what it does for me, how it feeds me. So I often do pick flowers. And um, here's what I want to confess to you. When you're feeling down, when you're feeling not satisfied in self, whatever the present circumstances are in your life, do not then deprive yourself 
of things that uplift you, things that satisfy you beyond monetary, right? Because I know a lot of times we do deprive ourselves when we are down or some people overindulge, which I've learned any spectrum to an extreme is destructive. I got off my ass and I went outside and I'm glad I did. I'm not pussy. <laughs> if you guys have watched my videos, I'm far from scary. But going through this recent experience has triggered some things in me that I myself am not comfortable with myself. I feel targeted because I don't know anyone here. On a brighter note, <laughs> Let's play some lyrical inspiration. <laughs> and uh, let me show you where I left off in the puzzle that I started this morning. It is coming along quite nicely. Huh. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I got it? Can you see it? I've been sticking it to my paper with nail polish, different nail polishes. And I like how they're coming through the cracks. That's part of being a creator, an artist, uh, expression. I'm eating chips, so I'm stuck in my teeth. And then some crossword. I was able to get some clear cords and decorate them. I also... So why do I share this with you? I share this with you, A, because it is testimony of my life. And uh, I truly enjoy sharing life with those that are willing to live it. On a higher frequency. You're welcome. I got these. Very pretty. But I'm not going to put them on until I finish getting this place how I want it. Right. Because I washed the walls. I mopped. I dusted. But I'm not done giving it my spice of life. My. Right. And I got some of these. A dollar twenty five. So when people tell me I don't have money for whatever, whatever, baby, it's perspective because you see this. I spent thirteen dollars in the Dollar Tree. I got bleach. I got a mop. I got fake nails. I got crazy glue. I got eyeshadow. I got mascara and a lip gloss. Right. I still haven't gotten the right shade of foundation, but I'm a work in progress. Right. Perfectly perfect. And I love it. <laughs> mm, I want to put on my dancing shoes. All right, guys. So, wherever you find yourself on this savory Saturday, I hope that you've had a serene, satisfying Saturday. I like the intricacy of words. So, there's a girl named Yemi something. I'm going to look her up. I like her song a lot. And I'm going to play it for us. And then, I'm going to be my fabulous self and show you what I did get from the staff member in clothing that I can absolutely dress up, dress down, and do as I please because uh, I am the brand as you are. Right, so represent. Her name is Yemi Alade, and um, it's called Baddie. I have a short clip to this song. I like what I like. And uh, now you get to hear the whole song. You're very welcome. <laughs> That's not the song, hold on. I don't have the copyrights, but you are very welcome. Yeah. We outside. We outside. Uh, oh yes, I went to the desert because I like to be outside. You are 
the occasion. Present yourself. so much. I got this whole mouth. Thank God! Better than the average. straps on it because uh I breastfed and uh I've lost a lot of weight but I could dress it up I could dress it down and I love being sexified it truly is a, a state of being <laughs> God did it right by me even when the world does it I do a dress up, dress down for you, so enjoy what I enjoy. The music and all that is life. Quien lo diría? Who would say? Everlast. Yes, baby, I'm everlasting joy. But I don't like that song. Now let me show you what else I got. And I tell you, it's like if they were waiting for me to come get this shit because everything is my size. Right, there's no coincidence. Brand new, never wore. God does right by me with my mama titties. Uh, uh. Oh, I got a 
bathing suit? Where I'm going? I don't know yet, but I know I'm ready. Look at this pretty little piece. I don't know if I showed you already, but I like it. I got some nice guest jeans. Hey, un pal de psycho es toqueado. I love dresses. Got some house to tie them. I don't really need clothes to be inside. I mean, this dress. I like crop tops. Son par de amigas. Enjoy your weekend, wherever you find yourself. I'm gonna dance it out, continue to praise my creator, and heal. I know that we're better than the circumstances, even when we don't feel like it. I had to push myself today to go outside. <laughs> do what you gotta do. I love you.